Take me from this place, oh, take me from this place. Is it heaven or hell? Only God can tell. Take me from this place. When the time comes, he'll hear me and take me from this place. He'll wash my cares of my nightmares. Take me from this place. I know you're there. You might as well come on out and say hello. All right, Joe. That's the last of it. I don't think that's the last. There's some more in the barn. Nope. Go. No, no, that's the last of it. I remember not saying nothing else. I want to be done by the end of the day, so do it now. Well, you still coming around here? This is our property. Go on home. Let him be. You know he can't be hanging around here. His mama wicked in these hills. Well, he's lonely. Oh, you his caretaker now? Y'all friends? No. Well, why is he always hanging around here like a moth to a flame? Why he's so ugly, he'll make a train take a dirt road. Boy, get on out of here. You get. Take this bucket back to the house while you're at it. Go. Miss Josephine? Yes. This morning, I tried to catch some crickets and flies, and I caught the crickets. See? Those are some mighty fine looking crickets. Mm -hmm. yeah. Guess what else? What? Tomorrow's my birthday. You know what that means? No, what? I'm gonna be a man. I won't be afraid of nothing no more. I won't have to listen to what mom would say. Where'd you get that? Minnie Mae. Oh, good Lord. Now you're gonna get yourself in trouble. You stay away from Minnie Mae and her hoodoo and her voodoo. She say, you go into the bitter woods, you catch a devil by the tail. I'll have to give you three witches. No, Bitter Woods is dangerous. You stay out. Do you hear me? Not here. But men don't let women push them around. Well, what do you know about being a man? What, why did you tell your brother we ain't friends? We are. No, Thomas, you and me are different. And that means that we can never truly be friends. But you're nice to me. Do you not want to be friends because you think I'm stupid? No, I, I think you're right fine, young man. That ain't a whole truth. Now, why don't you just go on home? I, I got a lot of work to do here. Fine, I'll go. But I'm taking the shortcut through Bitter Woods. No, 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 I'm warning you. No, no don't go in there. Thomas, Thomas Seymour. Damn fool. Josephine. Josephine. You had the baby? Can I see it? No. Something wrong with him. Something funny. I need you to take him. Do what my pa did to those stray kittens. I tried to do it myself, but... I couldn't do it, so you have to. What would your ma say? She'll never know. I don't want to. Do it, or I'll make up an awful story about you and no one will be your friend as long as you live.
Thomas? Are you in there? What's wrong? Ain't you the devil? <laughs> well, I am the devil. I'm the devil of bitter woods. Ain't you gonna eat me? No. Why not? But, 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 but Mr. Devil, sir, I, I don't understand. Why don't you want to eat me? I got bigger fish to fry. You ain't worth my time, Ingrate. No, 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 wait just a minute. I, I, I don't understand what ingrate means, but I demand to be treated the same as everybody else. I'm a normal person. I expect normal treatment. So you just go on ahead and kill me like you do all the others. Go on. Are you gonna follow me like some mongrel dog until I rip your throat out? Uh, yes, I, no, I just, I, I want some equal treatment or at least some answers. You don't know where you are. No, where am I? Have you ever heard the term inbred? Inbreeding occurs when two closely related beings mate and produce offspring. Now, these offspring may have genetic abnormalities or defects. In plain English, your mama's brother raped her on her 15th birthday, and nine months later she was stuck with the likes of you. No, that, that's not true. Oh, it is, Thomas Seymour. Your mama wanted to drown you in the river. She knew that you'd be slower and dumber and uglier than all the rest of her children on account of such an egregious sin. But at the last moment, pity stayed her hand. So you see, you are not normal, Thomas Seymour, no. You're an abomination. Now, if I were to kill you, well, <laughs> that's the easy way out for you. No, I want you to wallow in your miserable existence. You're, you're just like all the others. You're. You're an evil man. Oh, I'm evil. I'm no man. I am the devil incarnate. You're, you're lying. I can see you're, you're just a man like me. I'm a shapeshifter. I take on the form of whatever a person fears the most. In your case, you see me as a strong, strapping young lad. Something you fear you'll never be. Well, well I, I ain't scared of you. Look. Well, maybe a little. Well, 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 what other tricks can you do if you're so powerful? I can't command the elements. Take on any form. Any form? Prove it. Ah. Whoa. 
Where are you? Why are you hiding? something else like a, a frog or, or a bug or or a fly yeah change it to a fly <laughs> oh golly golly mr. devil there's no way you can get out of many maze go jar if I make you a deal I'll, I'll let you go, but you gotta give me three wishes. If not, I'll smash you dead. What do you say? All right then. <laughs> so my first wish. My first wish. Golly, I wish I could think of something clever to say. Darn it. My second wish is that you'll never be able to harm me or take revenge for trapping you in this Govi jar. Now for my, my third wish, third wish. Well, I, I know I don't want to be abnormal anymore. I don't want to be made fun of anymore or be called ugly or half-wit because it hurts me inside so much I can't take it no more. I am a man that people deserve respect and, and, and... One wish. Only one wish left. Smarter than I look. Oh, forget smart. You're honorable. You could have chosen different. You could have chosen No, me. no. There was only one choice I could have made for a friend. I made it. took my time and looked deeper into your pasts. Then I would have known the two of you are twin flames, twin souls. I would have never bothered with the Peria. But know this, Thomas Seymour. These here are my woods, my dominion. If you dare set foot in Bitter Woods again, your wish will not hold. I will gut you alive and drink every last drop of your filthy blood. Why, Mr. Devil? I wouldn't expect anything less. Mm -hmm. 